Sorry that went so quickly, but they got it's the The fastest spot. Count Jack ever got. It's the fastest <laughs> Count Jack. <laughs> well, and I guess everybody knows that this wonderful man celebrated his 70th birthday recently. And this past week went down to appear before the Congress, which is looking into what needs to be done to restore boxing to the greatness of his day. And I don't want to put you on the spot, but you have made it public that you feel that some federal control in the field is necessary. I Jack. certainly do, John. This is long overdue. And if something isn't done, I'm afraid boxing will really pass out of the picture. Well, I hope that never happens. But more, I hope we can restore it to the luster of the days when Jack Dempsey was champion. Let me tell you one story about John, Jack. John, I'd like to ask Jack one question, yeah. which he probably won't answer. What is your opinion of that recent so-called fight between Cassius Clay and Sonny Liston? Well, I didn't exactly see the fight. I saw it on TV afterwards, but let's don't dignify it. Let me tell you one wonderful story about Jack. I think most of you uh, might have heard it, but some of you may have not, that during the last election, Gene Tunney's son was running for Congress down in California, in so the lower southern part of California. And guess who was down there campaigning for Gene Tunney's son running for Congress? Mr. Jack Dempsey. <laughs> and the best part about it is that uh, Mr. Tunney won and is now a member of the Congress of the United States and vitally interested in the, in the activity of the, the committee looking into the, Boston, the boxing world. Uh, he's a wonderful boy. Gene has three sons, and each one is nice than the other. They're all uh, wonderful fellows. And well, it's, boys. it's great that you and Gene should be such good friends in, in these Well, John, years. we've always been good friends. Of course, we boxed and all that, but that had nothing to do with our friendship. Even before we boxed, we were friends, I'd say, for 40 years. Since the time I fought Capanche, that was 1921, we've been friends all these years. Uh, well, and I know good, great and good friends. Well, uh, it's a little bit late to wish you a happy birthday, but I'm going to do it anyway. Thank you very much, John. And uh, may I say that nobody I've ever known has, has worn his years with your grace, and uh, you do honor not only the boxing and to your friends, but to your country, Jack, and we are all very proud of you. And thank thanks you, very much for sharing a Sunday night with us. It was very good. Night. <laughs>